Welcome back, Arizona. Yeah, take me on a trip. I want to go somewhere, anywhere. Earlier we showed you what to take a holiday trip close to home. Now we're going abroad. We are going to travel internationally to I enjoy the holidays. I have my passport. Okay, fantastic, because all three of these places I'm going to talk about, you need a passport. Okay, where and going? I want to start with the Caribbean. Okay. We have heard about the hurricanes and the devastation that took place. And right. I want people to understand that 70% of that region was not even impacted wow. in any way, shape, or form by the hurricanes. And I recently got back from visiting Jamaica oh, and a sandals and a beaches that resort. So that's me walking uh, on the beach at real sunset. Video. That's not I want video. you to know that December 14th, Beaches is doing a grand reopening of their family-friendly property in Turks and Caicos mm -hmm. and sandals how much fun would it be for Santa Claus to be on water skis yeah. there are three different beaches resorts there are more than 17 different places you can go visit on those luxury included accommodations meals uh, experiences non-motorized non water sports something for everybody oh, and the goodness. Caribbean yes. is open for business open for business support your friends out there they Absolutely. need our help right now and that's a lovely way to do it. It okay, is. what about Puerto Vallarta? A little closer to home, super short, easy plane ride is Puerto Vallarta, and it is filled with rich tradition, authentic culture, and during the holidays, they go all out. There's a celebration all about the festival of Our Lady of Guadalupe that kicks off December the 1st. The Malacan gets lit up and decorated mm -hmm. with festive stuff, and what I love about Puerto Vallarta mm -hmm is it's the rich of history, tradition, and culture with a vibrant nightlife scene, great restaurants, and like I said earlier, so easy to get yeah. there. Little simple to our plane ride from Phoenix. Yeah, I went there last January and had a blast. Some of the best coconut shrimp I've had. Agreed, Delicious. so terrific. Shall we go to Europe? Let's go to Europe. You know, it's very intimidating sometimes to think about planning European trips. Yeah. And the Christmas markets are those once in a lifetime experiences you may oh have. Gosh, yes. So what I wanna encourage people to do is something that, that makes this easier is a tour operator. What does that mean? A tour operator, someone like Trafalgar Tours, for 70 okay. years, they have been leading people on what they call the good life. Oh. And they've got a Christmas markets tour nice. that takes care of everything, your accommodations, your meals, Perfect. your experiences. And this one for the Christmas markets goes to Austria, it goes to Germany, it goes to Switzerland, takes oh. you to those types of places. And it's not as expensive as you might think. Once you pay a tour operator okay. and they take care of all of those other things for you, you're not reaching in your pocket every five seconds for hotel that feels good. for meals yeah and then you can bring home all the souvenirs from the Christmas market to everybody yep. that you love for holiday oh, I did gifts. my Christmas shopping in Europe this yes. year <laughs> very fancy isn't that, that is fancy? Very fancy you know I have a Facebook page the travel mom mm -hmm. I've said before I don't sell anything on yeah. my Facebook page I give trips away I'm so grateful to be able to talk about travel and I share bet. these experiences with people that I love sharing it through my Facebook page the travel well, mom you know if you need an intern a grip I can carry a bag whatever yeah, you need as long as you can carry my suitcase yeah you can come. I can do that. <laughs> Thank Plus, you. we'd have so much fun together. Oh, we'd have a blast. Yeah.